Hello and welcome to all my Mariner friends. Let's discuss file convention in detail. I will be also telling you many question and answer which may be asked in your oral examination. International Convention on Facilitation of International Maritime Traffic, 1965. Main objectives are to prevent unnecessary delay in marine traffic and to aid cooperation between governments. To secure the highest practicable degree of uniformity in formalities and other procedures. This convention reduces the number of declarations to just nine documents which can be required by port authorities. Seven were approved by IMO. The fall convention defines standard and internationally agreed measures which are necessary and practicable to facilitate international maritime traffic. To reduce workload basically for ship staff running in short voyages. Now question may be asked. Why does FAL convention come? The basic concept of file convention was to reduce the unnecessary red tape procedures, unnecessary formalities and providing a uniformity between the Gov, between other agencies which are dealing with maritime traffic. Historical port clearance was complex and frustrating. Every country has different rules and regulations, custom immigration and other standards independently to each other and ships visiting numerous countries can expect to fill many forms. To tackle this problem IMO introduced the Fall Convention in 1965 enforced on 5 March 1967. Latest Amendments in File Convention From April 2019 File Convention is mandatory for ships and ports to exchange fulfilling data electronically and also encourage the use of the single window concept in which all agencies and authorities in the world exchange data via a single point of contact. Annex of file convention has the legal text and is written by the lawyers so language of this is complex and not easy to understand to make it easier there is an explanatory manual for the convention on file which contains guidance and interpretation for a greater understanding this manual was last reviewed and updated by file 45. Currently 116 out of 173 IMO member states have ratified this convention approximately 92.3% of the world fleet by tonnage. There are 57 member states of the IMO which have not yet decided on the convention. Continually amended and updated by government at the file committee of IMO which usually meets once a year at IMO London headquarter. Any member state can forward any amendment it can propose. In the same way, every member is a part of the file committee. General structure of file convention. There are 16 articles and one annex. These 16 articles contain general provision of the scope of the invention and the notification and their entry into force requirements. One annex contains standard and recommendation practices on formalities, documentary requirements and procedure, which should be applied on arrival, during their stay, on departure there, crew passenger, baggage and cargo. It contains the procedure for implementation and appendix that provide additional information to the convention. Appendix 1 MO file forms and Appendix 2 form of stowaways and details. File forms and certificates. File convention includes a list of documents which public authorities can demand for a ship. These documents cover maximum information and number of copies which should be needed. Under the convention, there is committee IMO has developed, standardized documents for, authorities which are known as file forms. There are seven standard forms, and three additional declarations, and two other documents. IMO standardized seven forms. Form 1, IMO general declaration, five copies. Form 2, cargo declaration, four copies. Form 3, ship store declaration, four copies. Form 4, crew effect declaration, two copies. Form 5, crew list, 
4 copies. Form 6, Passenger List, 4 copies. Form 7, Dangerous Goods, 1 copy. Additional Declaration from 1st, January 2018. Security related information is required, under SOLAS Chapter 11 by 29.2.2. Advance electronic cargo information for custom risk assessment purposes. Advance notification form for waste delivery to port reception facility. Other documents may be required under below mentioned convention. Those are two documents. Universal Postal Convention. International Health Regulations. The file committee session number. 39 of 2014 has agreed that electronic certificates should be treated as equivalent to traditional paper certificates. Committee has also agreed that electronic certificate viewed on computer should be considered as meeting the requirements to be on board. DOCU can show electronically but SMC certificate to be shown original hard copy. Many time question is asked that tell me. List of certificates, to be carried under file convention, on board ships. You should say. International tonnage certificate. International load line certificate. Intact stability booklet. Damage control booklet. Minimum safe manning certificate. Certificate for master, officer and rating. International oil pollution, prevention certificate, oil record book. Shipboard Oil Pollution Emergency Plan Garbage Management Plan Garbage Record Book Cargo Securing Manual DOC, SMC To facilitate, clearance and inspection periods, for ships in port, the file committee took a joint initiative, with other IMO bodies for online access, to certificates, and documents. The file committee has agreed that, Electronic certificates should be treated as equivalent to traditional paper certificates. Standard and recommended practices, the convention defines standards as internationally agreed measures which are necessarily practicable in order to facilitate international maritime traffic. If any contract and governments find it impractical to comply with any international convention or deems it necessary to adopt different Regulations they must inform the Secretary General of IMO about the difference between its own practice and the standard, and the same procedure applies to new or amended standards. Recent Amendments The Foul Convention 2016 Amendment in Force 2018, Electronic Exchange of Information CHU 2009 Amendments in Force 2010 text of voyage number and facilitation for cruise ship 2005 amendment in force 2006 avoids duplication documents and encourages electronic transmission of information and reference to ISPS code 2002 amendments in force 2003 new standard and recommended practice for dealing with stowaways dangerous goods manifest foul form 7 question may be asked. Why is stowaway and foul convention, why not in others like SWA convention? Ans. SWA convention is suppression of unlawful activity. ISPS, talk about, proactive measures, for approach. That what action you can take to avoid it. Stowaway is in the foul convention, because it talked about international maritime traffic. If the stowaways, are already on ship, and in control of the ship then he is no more into the ship. If a stowaway has committed, any crime then it will come under SWA. If stowaways carry any weapon, then it will come under SWA. But carrying a weapon, is not mean that he has committed crime. Next question. If a stowaway does not have any ID proof, or travel document what will you do? Pens. Full set of fingerprints three passport size photographs, a sworn affidavit by the stowaway, explaining how he came on board, what is his motive for stowing, and extraction from the logbook. Explaining how, 
when, where the stowaway boarded, the vessel and tried to hide him, or herself in the complete form available in Annex 1, of Fall Convention page 13, 14. Now let's discuss stowaway. General principle of stowaways. Storage incidents, should deal with humanitarian principles. Due consideration must be given to the operational safety, of the ship and to the safety, and well-being of the stowaways. Public authority, port authorities, ship owners and masters should cooperate in full extent possible way, to resolve stowaways cases, expeditiously and arrange an early return, or repatriation of stowaways. Next question stowaway focal point. On recommendation of Intertanko, or Intercargo IMO opened the stowaway focal point, to provide guidance to the master, and ship owner to deal with stowaway. It's like a helpline number, where the master or ship owner can call. A focal point will help, the master to deal with matters, related to stowaway. They also provide diplomatic arrangements, to the master, and ship owner by engaging, with customs, and immigration authorities when stowaways, need to be disembarked. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe. I will be adding more videos and feel free to ask me more exam related questions.